Hey everyone! Let me turn that down just a little bit. We welcome to our first Pokemon Duel game. I've already went through and did the um, initial where Lucas tells you what's going on and how you do everything. And I've actually played two games, daily missions. Play one more. Oh, okay. Now I got that one for my second daily. Okay, and now I gotta play a room match. So let's check out the room match. I'm gonna go to public once it pops up. All I ever do is just hit public and it puts me right in a in play. Public and play, and then it puts me right into a game. It finds me an opponent. So, how many of you guys are actually playing Pokemon Duel? It's an actual fun game. Um, Joey got me into it, and I thought that Elie and Claire played it. I thought they did. Dual opponent preparing. Woo! But Joey got me into playing it, and since then I I love it. I've restarted a couple times. In fact, I have a have it on my phone, which is a little further. But I'll let Joey do, play on that one, or I'll just get rid of it. Okay. For me, I like to put somebody on my goal and then one right here. Right on this one. So I'll move Squirtle over one and then I'll bring Charmander out and put Charmander. In fact, I'm bringing Charmander out now. <coughs> Alrighty, wow. Going for the juggler. At least it was only poison powder. Alright, so get you here. And you can stay there. Bye, Balthazor. Okay, now I think I have... Which I've never done this before. You choose two of your Pokemon on the field or bench and switch their position. You end turn, you cannot select two from the bench. Okay. I don't want that then. Alright, let's... Let's go, Balthazor. You are coming right at me. I can't use it because I've already... Darn it. I'm gonna attack. Ray battle. <laughs> Ray battle. That's actually a really good name. Oh, you're up there quite high on your ranking. Oh, you didn't. Alright, let's try to take her out. Quick attack. Bye, sweetie. One, two, three. Mm. I should have used it. I didn't use it again. 
final. Alright, Charmander. Okay. Am I confused or something? Is that why that's... Yeah, I'm confused. Um, he's poisoned. We did a plus 30. So when I come up here and I attack this one, skim skimmer, sk skimmery. Oh, the freaking confusion. He's got this game. He had it to begin with. But of course, he's 500 points over me. My Rattata ain't gonna do jack. Oh boy, was I wrong. <laughs> you go, Rattata. And I will not battle him this turn. I'm going to allow him to initiate the battle so that this way, if I do win, the next move is for me to jump right on home plate. Or if I withdraw and protect myself, the next move is to jump right. Well, it would have been to jump right on there if... I forgot about that withdrawal it takes. Well, that's right, you're confused. You just stay there, Pokemon. Pikachu, you confused Pokemon. Oh, did he lose connection? Oh no. I don't want to win like that. It says he's trying to connect. I don't want to win like that. That's just not right. Come on, dude, connect. That, that's a cheap one. That's just a cheap one. That was a cheap one. Oh, it gave me the bonus. So if it lands on blue, you get 30 gems. Pink, a rare metal. Uh, ingot, UC times four. The booster pack. And this little white patch up here, that's 70 gems. Okay. Alright, let's open this one. See what I can get out of it. Tap. And Diglett. And an ingot. Okay. So let's check out our deck. Edit figures. Now you can set evolutions for your Pokemon, so I'll explain a little about evolutions. You can set evolution from your. Let's go now. Edit figures. First, let's see the figure to evolve. Select a figure. Choose a deck. Now that this deck is set, the Evolve button has appeared. Select it now. 
Only certain figures can evolve. Yes. You cannot select an evolved Pokemon that is already set in the same deck. Select an evolved figure. You've now set an evolution. You can evolve your Pokemon in battle if you knock out or move an enemy Pokemon with it. If it evolves, attacks with 10 or more damage gain plus 10 damage. When purple attacks, gain plus one star. If you evolve a Pokemon, the uninvolved form will not gain experience for the duel. Okay. Okay, so now we're going to edit. Edit. Thank you. Let's see, he's a two and a two. Break the tape. Put him up there. Put him up there. Now we want to go to fusion. Fusion is where you can those ingots in that, like these here. All right. See, he's already level two. Level two here. He's level one. Level one. Level one. And seeing that they have higher moves, we want to. And of course, they're all only one point. So he'll go up to. Uh, I don't know. He'll gain five. Done with that. I don't know what the menu button does, honestly. Oh, okay. Okay. Alright, let's start. Oh, I can start this one. Start them all. Okay, let's start our quest. <coughs> Let's start the quest. Hey, Luca. Well, Joe Mama, here's where the opening ceremony is going to be held. Looks like it's already started. Oh, yeah, you've never had an AI before, have you? And the tournament will do alongside AIs, which are built into our devices. Your AI can provide support during the duel by moving your figures for you. Huh? You haven't activated your device yet? Let me take a look at it. How weird. It doesn't seem to be working. Here, you try. Let's tap on it. Tap on it. Ooh. Carlo, ta-da! Ta what? Or you scared me. You scared me. Apologies for startling you. My name is Carlo, your faithful AI assistant. I'll be providing you with all the support you need from here on. Would you like me to demonstrate my usefulness in a duel? Whoa, it talks. I've never seen one like that before. Oh, it's time for the opening ceremony. Let's get moving. Alright, and this is where we start out at. Level 1. And, like most of it, you have your energy up here. So, clear the quest on each floor and work your way to the top of the hotel. Let's try this quest first. To take on a quest, you need energy, which refills automatically. I think it takes like 2 minutes, 2 and a half. Here you can check the stats of your opponent's deck. You can also select which of your own decks to use in a duel. Press play once you're ready. It's simple, but I'm going through it as if I've never been through it before. Maybe you guys haven't been. I forgot about this. Behold, my dear participants. The hotel shall provide the stage for the PG... 
PFG World Championship. Each hotel owner lies in wait on the top floor of their hotel. They hold with them an emblem representing that hotel. The first player to collect all nine emblems and ascend Jewel Tower and defeat its owner, you truly shall be crowned champion. Where's my chapstick? Nestor Rose is famous for owning Jewel Tower. Master Rose, the undefeated re re reigning champion. Today marks the start of the preliminary phase. Phrase, phase. Only those who collect at least five emblems may remain in the tournament. Your first battleground is Hotel Olex. Its owner, Mr. Yuji, awaits all challengers who make it to the top. This is not a team game, dear contestants. Everyone around you is now your rival. So, are you prepared? On your marks, get set, go. <laughs> Ready to get started? Make sure you get past the preliminaries, okay? I'm going on ahead. Catch you at the top. Bye, Luca. See you in a little bit. Believe it or not, you interact with Luca quite a bit. Concierge. Honestly, I prefer to go second and let them go first. Because when you go first, it automatically takes one move away. So instead of your threes up here, Bulbasaur, Charmander, and Squirtle, now you can see they're all twos. And Pikachu, Tentacle, and Diglett are now all ones. So that's why I technically prefer to have the Concierge go first. And I'd like to see which way they're coming out. Oh, Charmander, I didn't want you there. I'm actually going to use you to battle. Bulbasaur, I want you to be on the... You coming after me? No. That's okay. One, two, three. Let's get this out in use on Charmander. Yes. We're running you to here. And we're going to attack the Bidoof. And like I said, it adds that 30 right onto it. And his Pokemon's gone. Now he'll bring another one out. Oh, you are not even going to try to... Way to go, Charmander! Win! I love my nails. Can you see? They're uh, heat changing. They're called mood, but it actually goes by heat. In this round, you only get two experience, but you get 40 gold, so that helps. And yes, you need the gold to help. Um, Oh, I got all of them. Move Pokemon in a hundred moves or less. Battle one time. Win by moving a Pokemon to the goal point, not a weight victory. A weight victory is where you put two Pokemon on each side of his board to where he cannot bring out any Pokemon. And you take out whatever Pokemons are on the board. Oh, Trioga. But it's called mood changing. It's actually a very dark purple, but it does kind of look black. But it is a dark purple when it's cold. And when it's warm, it turns the pretty blue color. But I am so loving them. Deck check allows you to compare your deck with the opponents in exchange for coins. Why not give it a try? This first one's on me. Here's your deck. 
Check your deck against your opponents. Held one, needed one, based on data prior to the first move. So it'll tell their stats against our stats to see if our deck is really good. Over a thousand points means your deck is good. Now we play. It does it on the second battle. It always does. I mean, every time I've started over, which this is like my fourth time, um, you gotta go through all this. I could, you can do data transfers. It's easier on your phone than what I have set up. Um, so I honestly did not, I just figured because I wanted to do the recording of it, I might as well start fresh. This way I can actually do a full walkthrough recording. Unlike what happened with Roblox and that where I just started continuing to play and forgot that I wanted to make it like a walk through. Alright, Charmander. We're gonna just go right upside the outside wall. Pikachu, let's take you there. Nope, he has no Oh, you out here? One of these, you have to have all five of your guys out on the board. You have to bring out every one of your players. So now, one, two, three. I won't have to use my thing this time, but next time I'll put on my 30 attack. Yeah, I didn't figure he'd be coming towards me. Is it? Charmander? Yes. And we gotta make sure we hit the right one because I would hate to have to waste it on. There we go. Oh, and you still have those moments to where you can still get. Okay, so let's. Oh, you just came right after Tentacool, huh? Okay, well, let's move Pikachu up then. One, two. Ah, let's poison him. Come on, poison! Nope. Tentacle barrier. Or bar Tentacle barrage. Alright, Pika. You know, Fletching is going to jump on that goal. Is it going to attack? Or is it going to let me attack? Yep. That's what I figured. Okay. So let's be sneaky. Yes! That's why I don't attack. Because if I would have attacked... I would have had to wait, and he could have brought one of them out. But now, I don't have to. I can just go right onto home plate. And another win under our belt. I do kind of like the music. We've got two experience, 40 coins. Did get them all. Mm, Pokemon battle in time. Okay. Now, if I was to be smart, I would actually check that before I go in. Good, I wanted the coins. As you can see, you can go back through it all the way, which I'll show you here in a second. Because there's honestly two. See, it does say you cleared it, but right here, one out of two. You can go back in it and play again, and hopefully get the other box, which... I got Chiogre, so I'd want the chest, the red one. Let's go back. Now, move a Pokemon onto the opponent's goal, moving 100 
Fighter, last battle one time, so I'm gonna move any Pokemon to the goal, I'm not awake there. Okay. See, and up here's your energy. And, like I said, it does build back up pretty fast. But the only thing we really need the energy for is the quest. I do not believe you need the energy to duel opponents in the beginning. Who's, who went first? Me. I sound so thrilled, don't I? Why'd I do that? That's a marrow. Fire would work good on him. No, electric would work better. Electric would work better. <laughs> the music change when you get on the opposite side of the board. He's gonna attack me with one of them. Oh, he did choose that one. Nice. That's gonna be a quick battle. That was quick. And some of them you do get nice and quick like that, and others you're sitting there fighting for a while. Eight experience that time. First win bonus. And you actually get, for getting all three of those, you actually do get um, bonuses in that. In fact, we've done three now. Let's go and check it out. I think I've got the bonus on two of them. You just hit leagues because it'll take you back to the front. Open it up. You got three messages. Oh, I did clear them all. This one I got three. Three. And this one should be three also. Up here, you can just click get all items and it'll accept them all for you. And then you don't have to go through that. Okay, let's go back. No, let's check something out. Yeah, no, it doesn't cost you nothing to play in here. That you hit play. This is just a random dual opponent. It's not a quest. It's just randomly fighting people to build up your other levels for your own. In here. This level. Oh good, he's only one point ahead of me. Okay. So, come on, Squirtle. Squirtle, Squirtle. Squirtle, Squirtle. Ooh, I like that one. That one's a pretty one. What is that? What is it? Oh, that's plus. Plus one. And minus. Or minimum. Get you going out. Bring Pikachu out. Sage, you don't play around, huh?
Come on, Pikachu, let's take out Plessy. Eighty, nice. Now he's gonna that's what I figured he'd do. Good, Thunder Wave. But Thunder Wave paralyzes him, so he can't move. So he's stuck there. So let's go get Charmander down here and take out C dot. We broke even. C dot, that is C dot. Flame tail, yes. Are you still confused? Yep. And a win under our belt. It'll bring up our promotion to bring us up our rank. Rating League promotion and 74 more points. I got a time booster and I got three key fragments. Which, once you get 10 key fragments, you can unlock a booster. Okay, so that one's going. So let's try that again to try to get one up. Because once you unlock a booster, you can open it automatically. It doesn't have to be, um, you don't have to go through any time to open it. It opens. Just like when you buy the EX packs in that, which I'll show you here in a, as soon as I'm done with this battle. Yes, go first. Oh, he's under me. He's three points beneath me. Lower than me. Okay, Squirtle. One, two, three. Bulbasaur. Mm -hmm. Alright, Squirtle, you come right on the thing. Charmander, we're gonna bring you up. Yep, that way. One, two, three. One, two, three. What is that? A Luxray, Vidoof, Chimchar, and a Piplup. Because you know you're gonna be in that battle. So you might as well take them out. Now Piplup's going to move over. Oh, you're going to come up on this side and attack. You're not attacking? You're just letting me win? Even I play defensively. Promotion in 75. Promotion. Promotion. Dun, dun. Oh, then I got three chests. Here's the lock booster. What shall it be? What shall it be? Wow. I've never had that one before. Ah. Yeah. 
It's only uh, one move though. Alright, let's check her fusion, see what those ingots that I got are. Um, 534, 540, 538. I said 534 for both of them, and it's 538 for both of them, and it's 540 for Charmander. So let's. Squirtle. It only gives them one point. Where did that take that from him? There it goes. Okay. This one doesn't do anything. I wonder if it's just because of him or... Oh, but you could use uh, Pharaoh. It's a ground. Yeah. Fighting. This one is this. And that's his level for him to evolve. That's what that's for. The green ones help them evolve. Alright, how many? Oh, I only have 197. I might be able to get one. Boosters. Single. Yep. I want to save it up for this. Because you get at least one regular EX figure. So let's go. And then, of course, you got your material exchange. Those fragments you get. Like Dialga's 4000. Materials are pieces of figures that are given away to customers who purchase boosters. Here you can view the materials mm -hmm. in your possession. Once you collect in enough materials, you can exchange them for the figure of your choosing. So say we wanted to get Steelix, he's 1800. Luxray is a 1800. Squirtle is 450. Ho O's 4,000, Charizard's 4,000, Dratini, Helik. I mean, I think they got all of them. Drudy John Hell. Moltres, or Takuma. I don't know if they have Mew or Mewtwo. Uh, Alright, let's go do some more battling so I can show you an EX pack. And then... I believe that'll be pretty close to being it. Because I do believe I'm over 20 minutes already. Okay, let's see. Move a Pokemon onto the opponent's goal in 75, battle two times, and win it without it being a weight bit.
You can go first. You're more than welcome to. Should know better. And yes, it is that cold again today. So what types do we have? Fighting, ground, and flying. So... Let's... I'll get my three out. Oh, and those UCs, you can only use them once in a round, once per round. So it's best to try to think ahead. I try to wait until it's like here. Now, here is the Pokey Center, where they're healing. This one will move to here once one of your... Every time one goes in, it always comes here. If there's one here, it'll push it here. If there's one here, it'll put it back into your deck, but it's got a one, one turn wait. And then after that turn, the next turn you can use him. He comes out on the one turn, the other guy goes, you can use him. You've had one battle, this will be the second one. I can't believe we just sat right there. See, now I'll use it here, because I will be battling him. And bring it here, and that'll be one, two after the next. And I think all he's got are two, so. Quick attack, yes. It would have been a tie, it would have been a draw without that extra 30. Okay, so he's got twos, one. He could come over here and attack. There's always that chance that they fail, and you win. The first couple rounds are very, very easy. And then, of course, I had one time where the first or the second guy whooped me. I think it was when I was first starting to learn how to play. I mean, he just whooped me down. Meryl! I love me a Meryl. Especially when I can get it to evolve into Amaral. That's one bad Pokemon. Alright. I should have. That should have given me at least three more. Messages. Get all items. Yep, and gave me my three more. So, let's go shopping. Boosters. Exchange quadruple. Yes. We get four new booster packs. Four new Pokemon. Hopefully, new Pokemon. And hopefully the EX is really good. Ooh, hoo hoo. Hey, hoo hoo. You're not a ditto in disguise, are you? No? Didn't think so. Last time I got the Charizard EX on my phone account. But he only moves once. For an EX, he was a really low moving is that it? Nope, that's Vivera. I think the fourth box is normally your EX. 
which one do we got now? Adino. All three of those were new, and of course, the EX is new also. And come on, what EX am I getting? Hydreigon. Hydreigon? Let's see. Oh, I got a plate too. Ooh, I got two plates. And material. Well, I got 200. You've detained a figure with an ability. Let's take a look. Let's take a look at it. This Pokemon deals plus 10 damage for each Dino or Zelius on the field. Oh. Hmm. One other Pokemon on the field spins. If they spin a miss or a white attack of 70 damage or more, they are knocked out. Hmm. But, like I said, he only moves one. Which, I mean, it ain't bad. He's got Flamethrower. Which also burns them if he's knocked out. And Dark Pulse. Nice. Alright. I don't... I don't know if I want to put him in my... I could take Diglett out. I love Tentacle, but I gotta have me my marrow. Oh, okay. He's got two evolutions. And then you can say instead of Pokemon Switch, we'll put Confused heal. So now if my people are confused, I can heal them. If they're paralyzed, I can heal them. Oh, that's sweet. I didn't even know that. Alright guys, thank you for watching this episode. There will be more. Don't worry. In fact, once it's done rendering, I will be recording again. You guys have a great day. Bye.